Hey guys, today I'll be reviewing my brand new Hollow Death Scyther. Let's get straight to it. Here are the parts of the Beyblade. Here, starting with the chip, we have the brand new Death Scyther Sparking Chip and Core. The core is fused. Um, I'm, not, I'm not sure if it actually is, but that's what I've done with it. Pretty nice color scheme. The whole thing was broken down from um, Death Diabolos, so there will not be any more battles or reviews with him. Um, this guy instead. Now, the layer here is hollow. Very nice. Reminds me of Killer Death Scyther or Doom Sizer. Very nice. I like it a lot. Love the clear. I think it's a pretty good looking bay in general. On the side here, you have the little blue stripe that goes down the, what you call it, the claw. You put the chip inside, and that is what it looks like. Next up here, this is the Chassis 4A. Nothing very special. It is not purple, because I did not have enough purple pieces. This gear is quite simple. It is just 12, no frame. I know it does have a frame, but just 12, because I didn't have the pieces to. There we go. The driver here is full, I believe. It is a dash one, so we do have some red contents. Please do not tell me this is white. I know it is white. I made it black because those are the pieces I had. Assembling the bay. We have Hollow Death Scyther. Very, very nice. There are some little pictures there of like what it looks like fully, fully assembled. And yeah, so thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!